to the pool. We swim every day. <laughs> Get a lot of, uh, I think, aerobic conditioning from swimming uh, in our program. Which is good because it doesn't beat the body up as much. It's historically been one of my my strongest parts of the race with my, um, you know, swimming background. It's been a little off this year. Um, so just trying to bring it back. Uh, obviously, a big part of the race strategy is try to get, you know, that break in the swim like we did in 2019 with the strong group of riders. Uh, and if St. George, the world champs in St. George is any indicator, a lot of these young guys are, uh, are keen to push the swim in the bike. So uh, there could be a lot of allies. Um, Hopefully they're all smart. You can do a lot of stupid stuff at the beginning of this race that can cost you a lot uh, later in the day. So, need good decisions the first half of the ride for sure. Strategically, it's just try to get out fast and hang in on that front group. Uh, I'm probably more prepared this year or I need to be more prepared mentally in case that plan doesn't work. Uh, you know, I've had some, I've had some okay swims and some not great swims. So uh, yeah, just kind of have every scenario in the head on how the race might play out just so you don't get too shaken if, um, you know, your, your A plan doesn't start to come together. sets or strength sets with your paddles or or the towel and band is, is dips like to use. Um, uh, I love my like buoyancy shorts especially at altitude when you're tired and, and we do a lot of hard runs swimming right after hard runs and as I've gotten older that's gotten a lot harder to back up so for me the shorts are a great way to keep my body position and uh, not have to stress too much to um kind of um, get that speed so when I was younger I thought they were cheating but now I know that they're a valuable tool <laughs> That was all right, yeah. Sadly, the best beats that I've had in a while, but I also got crushed. <laughs> in the week, but I don't know. It looks, I can't tell if it's going to be shit or if it's going to be good. I mean, it looks like they've got cappuccinos and little snacks and stuff. Or we can go somewhere downtown, but I don't know if we have that much time. No, we don't have that much time. McLean's? We either need to go to JNS or McLean's. What's JNS? Well, JNS, didn't you say you didn't like JNS? It's got a high rating on here. What is JNS? Let me look at it really quick. 4.8. What's JNS? It's a coffee shop right here. Yeah, it's like two seconds away. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. But it looks like they've got good scones, though. I'll take you guys there. I'll take you there. <laughs> it doesn't look like they have any food, though. Wow. Oh. There's uh, that other place. There's tea loft over here, too. You guys want to... Tea loft? Did you go to tea loft last time, Matt? You want you want to look it up see what you think? I was showing you that. Remember, they have food there. I mean, the food looks good. 
Are you gonna get something, Tim? I'll get something, yeah. I mean, I'm keen to try tea loft. It looks healthy. Do they have um, coffee or no? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, they do have coffee. I mean, worth a shot, no? Yeah. Made worse decisions in my life. Yeah, like scone lady. The sc- <laughs> hey, there's another scooters over there, Justin, if you want. Scooters, man. If you want another cold brew. Scooters, 2.2 out of 10. That's 2. a legitimate 2. score. That's not like a fake score, like, oh, it's bad, I'm gonna give it a zero. That's like, a 2.2 is almost worse than a zero. Because <laughs> if you're gonna go out of your way to legitimately rate it, like, you know it's bad. That's about as low as you as I can give coffee. You had to think about it. You, I thought, about, thought it. about it. And I like, I like pretty much all coffee. For me, it just has to be like black and decent. This is, this was so bad that it almost tasted like iced tea. <laughs> I thought it was the same as Starbucks. Is this the right parking lot? It wasn't even close to Starbucks. Starbucks. It wasn't even close to Starbucks. Starbucks is 10 times better. Starbucks is, in my opinion, solid 6.8. 6.8 or 6.2? 6.8. 6.8. Yeah, 6.8. That's a professional score right there. That is. Yeah, that's not a rookie score. That's a pro score. You know it. But I'm a pro, so. Rock parking lot, guys. Uh, do you want me, are we going? We're going to T loft. Yeah, I think I it's think, over here. I think it's on the left. Yeah. I can go straight through the light. I just don't have the. Uh, uh, I just want to sit in the middle of the intersection. Tim, what's your story about Arby's? Oh man, my brother Matthew and I used to hit Arby's up all the time when we were swimming in high school because they had the five for five. That's five roast beef sandwiches for five bucks. Now. I don't want to seem like I'm old, but now I'm seeing a sign that says two for seven dollars. <laughs> five for five in high school, two for seven now. Inflation is real, people. This light is freaking ridiculous. 